So we're at the Sony booth here at uh, Eva. They've just showed, just announced the Sony, uh, Sony Tablet S and the Tablet P. The Tablet P is over there. It's the dual screen uh, convertible. Uh, sorry, dual screen clamshell. It's, it's here as well. There it is. Um, beautiful screen on this. Very light, I estimate. Probably about five, five to six hundred grams. Nothing more. Um, with a, a really nice kind of wedge design. It's fairly unique. Actually, gives gives you something to hold on onto on, on the left hand side if you're using it in, in this mode, which is uh, a little bit easier than other devices. Docking station here. So that's a charging docking station. I'm not sure quite what's on the back of it. The user interface is super smooth. There's some special apps they got here as well. Uh, they've got their own music uh, music player. Um, this is the right step. Reader, of course, we, we and I think there's the Music Unlimited, features, which is their, we don't want to say which yes, is their music browser. service. We really want to get down to, to use and there should be a video say, ah, store on here as well, which I don't see card, at right, the moment. Camera, oh, um, right? yeah. so on the ports, so where is a speak, speaker there? Very straightforward. Uh, this um, is uh, a USB, sort of actually looks like um, yeah, ah, the SD card so slot and I'm going to say micro HDMI there, different headphone output. It's, it's There's the uh, power, so volume up and down, reset button, the other speaker, the not much else there as you go underneath. There's the kind of carbon fiber look, look on the back design. But the screen is absolutely really, really nice and sharp. Excellent stuff on the screen. Obviously running Honeycomb. And as far as uh, screen resolution goes, well, it's at least 1024 by uh, 600. I'm not sure. Maybe it's even more. We can't get to the settings on this because they've been turned off on the demo. But there's also a... Huh. Some sort of speaker control here as well. Where's the speaker? Ah, right, the, the speaker's up there. The speaker's up there. I'm not sure that it's on. <laughs> Let's see if we can get a look at the uh, clamshell device. The Sony P, Tablet P. So this is the Tablet P, the dual, uh, dual screen Android tablet, clamshell, um, long and thin. That's not going to fit in too many pockets, maybe suit pockets. Just having a look, see, see what we've got in terms of ports on here. Looks like a HDMI, or is that a micro USB, difficult to tell. Power, power button. And there's the uh, headphone port. So not much in terms of uh, connectivity there. Screen is really, really nice though. Very, very white. But you can see actually some. It's not exactly an IPS display. Some fade off there, left and right, top bulk. But the actual quality of the screen is. The quality of the screen is really, really nice. Let's see if we can, obviously it's running a honeycomb here, split across two screens and fits pretty well together when it's open as well. Let's see if we can get the settings. So, it's running Android 3.2 on here. Um, so I didn't, I didn't want system update, I wanted to see whether there's actually a information on the uh, information on the actual CPU, but there's nothing I can see there. In terms of weight, mm, I don't know, it's a fairly dense device, probably 350, 400 grams. There's a camera on the outside there. Nothing on the back. And that's a plastic finish, so nothing to... Uh, Nothing too special in terms of um, 
So this is the Sony Finishing. Uh, Tablet S. Gonna be a so we'll see if we can get some specs for this. This is the one that's going to launch for 599 in September. So interesting one to watch. Let's see how it works as, a, as an e-book reader in portrait mode. Doesn't seem to be auto rotating. Let's see if we can find the actual uh, reader application. The reader application difficult to find. Can't see the actual reader app. Here's the reader. So, the idea is that it's supposed to be a reader held, held in this kind of mode, which is interesting. Ah, okay, there we go. Two-sided um, reading, actually not too bad, and that scrolls as expected with a swipe. Text quality is really, really nice. This is a very high-resolution display. Difficult to actually tell what the resolution is. Maybe 1024 wide, no, maybe 1280 wide, but 600 deep, who knows. Well, that's usable. And with the weight at around 400 grams, that kind of works. I wonder how browsing is with this sort of uh, size. Let's see. Unfortunately, the browser doesn't seem to split that way, but as it's almost a 4 3 screen, it doesn't really matter. Scrolling up there looks really nice. Tab browsing. So, anyway, we're talking about some very high speed browsing on this, so. Uh, Kind of maybe hints at what the CPU is inside it. It's a very high end CPU optimized browser. browser. Okay, let's leave it at that. That's the uh, Sony Tablet P. Okay, let's switch it over.